Hey everybody, I hope you're doing very well. I've got a short but sweet lesson for you this week. It's involving the six stroke roll. And I'm basically just gonna show you a way to displace this thing in a way that's gonna make it very easy for you to utilize this rudiment in fills and in solos. And you're gonna be very surprised at how easy this concept is to grasp. So check it out. The sticking we're gonna be using is right, left, left, right, right, left the basic six stroke roll. And if you play that slow to fast, it kind of sounds like this. So that is the template that we're starting from, that basic sticking, okay? And all I'm doing is adding to that a three note sticking. So you have the six stroke roll, which is obviously a six note uh, grouping, and we're adding a three note grouping of right, left, left to that, okay? And I'm going to show you an exercise where I go from the basic six stroke roll to that three note grouping, okay? And I'm gonna play the six stroke roll for four beats, then the three note grouping for four beats, and then go to two beats of each, then go to one beat of each, and then eventually go all the way down to where I'm playing the six stroke roll once, and then the three note grouping once, okay? Check this out. Once you've got this exercise down and you can do it slow and fast, then you can start to be creative with the number of times you're playing the six stroke roll and then the number of times you're playing that three note stroke, okay? And that's kind of what I was showing you at the intro. You can change from accenting on the snare to accenting on the toms, to adding the kick drum with the accents, to hitting the cymbals, just to do a bunch of different things, right? That's your time to be creative. Uh, and uh, yeah, that's pretty much it, you guys. I hope this gives you something to play with this week, something to challenge yourself with, and I appreciate you watching. I really, really do. I'll see you very soon. Have a good day.